<laughs> bumping up my propaganda and enforcement. Yeah, I'm a good dictator. <laughs> Yeah, London gain more followers. <laughs> oh no, they're leaving. <laughs> 55 people. Jesus. Oh, this is going to be bad. <laughs> Here we go. They are leaving. Sir, the time is at hand. The Londoners have gathered around the generator for the last time. They're going to leave the city. This is our last chance to stop them from committing mass suicide. Whatever they said and did, they're still our people, even if they no longer think so. Stay with us, you'll die out there. Hope is too low. Many people weep with hurt. Some may die. Or our guards to stop them. 55 people will leave the city forever. We don't have enough food. I will try to stop them. Serves them right, I say. If you're not with us, you're against us. Those fools would have died if we hadn't stopped them. If only they'd listened to us. There's no arguing with fear. It's a tragedy, but threats to order must be dealt with by any means necessary. Alright, so we're... We forced them to stay. <laughs> you ordered the guards to stop London at all costs, despite their wishes. Trap... Like caged animals, they fought tooth and nail for the right to decide their own fate, but they lost. We paid dearly for this victory. Some Londoners were badly beaten. Some of them died. What matters is that they stay. There are people again. All of them. 18 were injured and 6 of them died. Is there anything using uh, steam cores that I need to build? I don't think I can build any more. Oh, I can build more coal mines. Really? That will help out a hell of a lot. I did not realize that there was more coal to be gathered. Unexpected guests. Captain, a group of exhausted survivors has reached our city. The phrase doom is coming keeps being repeated. And they say many more refugees are following them. They're begging you to help them, sir. Let's be cautious. The group will enter our city. You, you'll decide what to do with the others later. We'll send out search parties to bring them to the city. Damaged snow cat. Bags of resources. We found some supplies into the side of the wreck. We'll surely find a good use for them. Take resources. Get a steal. And that's pretty much it. Yeah. I've explored it all. I guess I just have to disband them. How are we doing consumption-wise? Oh, hell. Well, then. Doing pretty well. How are we doing now? Still in, in the surplus. Wow, that's good. Refugees from Frostland running from the storm. A huge crowd of people have searched... As we our city, many of them are sick. They say that some kind of enormous weather anomaly is coming our way and that they'll die without our help. Please let us in. 70 people, 30 of them ill, will enter our city. Discontent will rise. Hope will rise. Oh, everyone's welcome. The second wave. Another huge group of refugees has arrived. Nansen led us north because his years exploring the Arctic taught us, taught him to survive here. Using natural resources. Nobody could have guessed what was coming, though. Should we let him in? Yeah. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> More sick beds needed. I will open a new infirmary. I will do this thing. Let's see. Where can we put more shit? Probably about here. No, 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 don't crash, don't crash, please. No. <laughs> All right, I think the game crashed. <laughs> At least it froze on me. Well, it was a good run. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's 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 crashed. There we go. Oh, it's not responding, but let's see if it... You know what, let's give it a little while. Ugh.
Oh, here we go. Now, new order. With the introduction of the new order, all who voice doubts will be treated as traitors. Wow. Obedience is the highest virtue, without which the city can't survive. All those who do not follow will be swept aside. Hope will never be a problem again. <laughs> Londoners will have to renounce their views. A public execution space will be built. Some Londoners will be killed. Not a problem. Some people will feel compelled to fight this law. Some of them will die. <laughs> sure, we'll do that. The new order. There will be blood. Sir, people are rioting in the streets and demanding that you stop this law. They say that order is about people working together to survive, not one man using the people's lives as resources, seizing more power for himself and killing freedom. Roughly a quarter of our people are determined to fight. The others are silent. Send the guard. I will sign the law. Hope is now obedience. Winter home fell, but we will succeed. Hope is for the weak. We have strength and courage. We are the chosen ones. At the last stand, we will prevail. The new order. The night of changes. Dawn breaks and the streets are silent. You've declared our city the bastion of the strongest, toughest, and most obedient people. There is no place in it for doubts, troublemakers, rebels, or un and reactionaries. Everyone who was a threat to the unity of our city under you as leader of the new order has been dealt with. 22 citizens died. The other have rejected their views. Hope will never be a problem again. No one will think in these categories anymore. <laughs> Jesus. Execution platform. Sir, an execution platform has been set up by the generator. Whenever you order it to be put to use, a public enemy will be executed. This will lower discontent greatly. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, this is so dark. Oh, it's incredibly dark. The third wave. Everyone is welcome. What looms ahead? Sir, now we can see, clearly see what the refugees were running from. The Great Frost is coming. Glory to a great leader. Well, that's not ominous at all. Very good. Repair from the so storm. Sir, the scientists couldn't believe their eyes. They say the strongest winds of the storm will cause the temperature to plummet beyond anything we've ever experienced before. Hunting will be impossible. The plants in the hothouses will freeze. Everyone left outside the city will perish. So will we if we can't heat our homes properly. We have to prepare. First of all, we need some resource depots. Run away child, sir. A man here is to see is he here to see you. He says that his daughter ran away after the news that storm spread. She won wants to borrow a scout sled and go after her. No um fuck it. Take him. What can we do? Hot house insulation. House redesign. No, they cost less. Damn it. <laughs> Should have taken that one. <laughs> oh. I did not see you, um, BW homie. Sorry about that. If you survive this, I will be very surprised. Yeah. If you pull this off, you, you're a legend. Oh, you're still here. Awesome. Dude, you might be screwed. Yeah, <laughs> I very much think I am. Focus on heating and, if, and efficiency for heating. Aha. Uh -huh. I thought I needed enough food to survive. But is, is heating more important? Yep, people die. <laughs> we, uh, they are sacrificed for the cause. Good luck, man. Yeah, well, thank you. This is never going to work. <laughs> the food is most important, but I was telling you before about heating because you have basically no coal. Yeah, I I, uh, I know. <laughs> Two people died. Two people died. Two people died. 
when people die. How is your house and medical insulation looking? Oh, don't, 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 don't ask those kinds of questions. Uh, uh, let's see. House, we're missing the last level of insulation and medical. Yeah, we're also missing the last one for the healthcare. In in my defense, I've never gotten this far before. I've I played this game a couple of times uh, over a year ago, and I picked it up today. And this is my first <laughs> my first run after spending over a year away from it. And I don't think I've ever gotten this far. So just the fact that I'm here is. <laughs> A victory in itself. <laughs> About midway through, I really regretted not having more of a plan with building the city. <laughs> oh, it's so bad. Oh, it's horribly structured. That's really good then, holy crap. <laughs> well, I don't know about that, but uh, I'm, <laughs> I'm just happy with the result I've gotten so far. Focus on what you need. Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. Should I go for insulation? Well, that would kind of lower the need for burning uh, coal, wouldn't it? Hmm. We're going to go for insulation, I think. Oh, that's the economy. Oh, right. Wow, I haven't actually used this view. <laughs> this is super helpful. Huh. Huh. Wait, those are not... Oh, my God. I've forgotten to upgrade them. Are you kidding me? <laughs> well then. I have to do that then. <laughs> What's calling looking like now since you did a couple of things to help it? Yeah, but not, it's not running on... It's running on like Steam Level 2. I think I'm going to sacrifice one of my wall drills for coal mine instead. I think that's going to be a good trade. I think so. All teams back in the city. Everyone with a mission away from the city is back and safe. Oh my god. I'm actually producing more, uh, generating more coal than I'm using. Holy bananas. <laughs> I did not think I would reach the level. Holy hell, am I actually going to reach the fucking goal? Wow. I did not think I would be able to even come close to generate enough food. The hell is happening? And now I'm burning this on full and... <laughs> Man, the fact that I forgot updating my, my coal mines... For fuck's sake. <laughs> wow. Come on. 3276. Come on! Come on! Yes! What? The people you say barely managed to reach the city in time. At least we have a critical supply of food ready. There's not much time left. We should use it to prepare whatever else we can. Well, after the storm hits, there'll be nothing we can do but wait it out. Holy hell. Are we actually going to make this? No. No, no. Let's not get our hopes up. So, wow, we're still good. Oh my god, this is... Ooh, it's, with, it's within reach. Get the generator bypass before you can't. I think I did? No, I didn't. Oh, man. I definitely saw that. I uh, thought that I did. There we go. Good call. Good call. People are furious. Sir, people are extremely discontent with your rule. A revolt could break out against you at any minute. What should you do? Send guards to calm them down. You must hold on for a couple more days. Why are you so furious? We're doing pretty well. Cut down it, people. Well, there are a lot of people that are sick. Fair enough. H hover over discontent and you know why they're mad. Yeah. It's the all-nighters all that are getting them. <laughs> Fuck them. It's either die or try <laughs> die trying. <laughs> That's true. That's very true. Wrap up well. the frost is here. Yes, the frost is here. The storm hits the city. The howling gale bursts upon the city and the generator creaks and groans under the weight of the wind. 
Pale faces turn towards rattling windows, trembling lips utter words of prayer. The cold will be brutal. Hunting is impossible. The soil in the hothouses will freeze. We'll have to make do what with the food we've stockpiled. The city must survive. We prepare well and the, for the coming storm. Now all that's left is to survive until it passes. Storm's harvest. Captain, the ill and their families. <laughs> no, I can't disperse a crowd anymore. Active guard station or faith keepers. No! <laughs> you have three dice to use triage. Okay, that, that I can do. That is easy. I hope you make it. Yeah, me too at this point. Uh, let's see. Where, where are my primaries at? There? Uh, triage. Half the patient will be healed and one fourth will die. Discontent will rise. <sighs> Ooh. I just used triage. Why didn't I register? Mm. Oh, there we go. Oh, prices. <laughs> I don't know what they're complaining about. Oh wait, did, did it use triage across all of them? Oh. Well then I really don't see what they're complaining about. Now it's fantastic. We have surplus capacity in our uh, healthcare system. The mines are freezing. So it's so cold the hydraulic roof supports in coal mines are failing. 10 volunteers were sent into each mine. Some of them may die. Yeah. 30 people died! All of them! <laughs> Jesus! So the volunteers managed to replace the critical supports in the lower levels of the coal mines. Our coal mines to play safe for now, but the cost was great. 45 of our people paid for their lives to give us a chance of survival. And the lives and names will not be forgotten. They will live on in our history forever. You'll need to use your overdrive for a generator when it gets really cold. Darkness before dawn. Sir, one of our engineers has come crashing through the door. White face, demand to see you. I've run the calculations with the new data. The storm will pass in a couple of days, but the temperature will just before the end will drop drastically. Nothing can protect us from such cold. Panic is starting to spread and people are losing all hope. You have to stay strong. Wow, we've uh, almost lost 200 people. <laughs> What is happening now? People refuse to work. Yeah, I don't really need the factory anyway, so that's fine. Sure, you can take a day off. Panic is spreading. Uh, fear of the storm. The people have abandoned workplaces. They were completely petrified. Many of them won't, don't believe we'll make it. This time, the entire staff of the car charcoal kiln have refused to go to work. Sure, let them stay home. Not essential. Not essential. Miracles happen. Sir, it's a miracle. The man who went looking for his daughter is back. What? what? That is a miracle. He brought her with him. He says that he found her soon after leaving the city, but then they got lost and had to wait for a lull in the blizzard to find their way back. They are both exhausted and frostbitten, but very happy. I'm glad to hear that. Holy crap. <laughs> I totally forgotten about him. <laughs> but I did, as the benevolent, benevolent leader I am, give him ten rations for his trouble. Uh, the cookhouse. Uh, sure, you can stay home too. Why not? Everyone deserves a day off once in a while. And that is an official message for your, from your benevolent leader. Ben benevolent? Benevolent. There we go. I'm gonna make it. I, I am gonna make it. Work ceases. Sir, most of our people have abandoned their workplaces to stay at home with their families. Only the medical facilities are still functioning. The city holds its breath, waiting for whatever the end will bring. It will bring survival, victory. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Holy crap. Minus 150, yeah. Everything's a bit cold at the moment. The storm ends. The wind dies down and the temperature fan starts to rise. An eerie silence descends on the city. Yeah, I have to turn another over here. I'm dry. It's over, I cannot believe it. It's finally over. Holy crap! I actually made it! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> you made it, man? Yeah, yeah. I I I I I actually did. <laughs> oh my god. Holy shit. <sighs> I fucking
fucking made it. Jesus Christ. <laughs> A new order? We crossed the line. I'm sure we did. <laughs> At the end there, just a lot of <laughs> order became despotism. Yep. Yes, it did. The city survived. But was it worth it? Questionable, yeah. Jesus, your city was crazy, land. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 405 citizens minus 30 uh, centigrades. Yeah, we started with a little over 600, so... <laughs> A lot of people perished uh, that last week. Holy shit, fuck. That's... That's insane. 